hopefully. Everyone's already gone to the party. You should hurry along there too. Would there be food? Party will begin soon. Would everyone please make their way to the party? Alright, I wanted to save I didn't mean pre sell. Oof. Already seeing uh, the new One Piece chapter trend. Oof, it was a good, good chapter. Are you enjoying yourself? The food today is being cooked by a top chef called in from one of the one of the Topia's finest restaurants. Oh. This gentleman is the boss of an IT-related in industry. He holds a huge market share worldwide. He's a very handsome man. Hey, it's because his money, ain't it? This lady is a boss of a famous famous oil company, you know. Oh. I never got bored of these flavors. I wonder if I could get wrapped, uh, get some wrapped to take it away. Or to, uh, take take home. A lavish spread of dishes from around the world. Man gets hungry. Go eat some food then. The food's superb, all made with the finest ingredients. A fine statue that features a mirror. Rest on a pillar. This is my company's best ever business opportunity. The party has to go perfectly. Ladies and gentlemen. I would like to thank you all for attending this party today. Uh, today where we are, we at Ubercore are proud to unveil our new booster system. We added to, uh, when added to any existing program, the booster system radically enhances the program and program's performance. Gosh dang. It's not your work, software R and D. It can be very uh, useful with uh, with anything. And of course, that includes net navvies. We're offering with just uh, a small <laughs> gosh, <laughs> a small amount here. Three hundred million zennies. That's three hundred million. That's oh, that's one ten a hundred thousand ten thousand a hundred thousand million a million hundred million. That's eight zeros. No way. 300 million, what a bargain. Let's see the device then. Oh, did, did you say it was a, a, a bargain? So, without further delay. The booster system is currently inside this view computer. If everyone would like to, to take a look, here it is. Oh. This is a booster system our company has developed. Surrounding it are garden navvies. Reinforced with the booster system. You are ten times more powerful than normal navvies. Ooh. And now you will all witness the power of the booster system. Ah, uh, power cut? Well, what's going on? What's happening? Is the booster system safe? Turn the lights on, quickly. Oh. It's gone. The booster system. What the... The booster system has been stolen. This is Nebula's doing. Where's that guy? Wait a minute. Hey, mister, when the power cut out, did anyone go in or out of this room? No way. I was guarding this exit the whole time. The mouse couldn't have gotten past me. And the thief is still in this room. Hey. This guy was hiding under the table. Oh. What do you think you're doing? Oh, I don't know anything about this. Quit playing innocent. I saw you in the danger room. Everyone, this guy's a nebula. What? Hey. Where's the booster system? Get it back now. Hey, it wasn't me. Oh, come on. Do you expect us to believe that? They're hiding under your clothes. Oh, oh. oh no. 
It's not his, in his pet, not in his clothes. Where is it? I already told you, I don't know. I was just about to take it when the lights went down. What? So, th th there's a, another thief at work here. Yeah, I'm not the only one. What? So we got another criminal to find among these people? Plan. It seems to me that everyone in this room is innocent. The thief must have somehow jacked into the view computer, defeated the eight guard knives, and taken the boost system. Would have been real hard to operate an heavy in the dark. It near impossible to beat up those beefed up guard navvies, so... It must have been some kind of trick. Let's look for the clues. Hmm. Based in with a built-in hologram system. There's also a port for jacking in. Yeah, I'll check that in a sec. What kind of person would take the booster system? This is inexcusable. What's going on? We're really in the pickle now. I'm the captain of this vessel. I can't believe this happened on my ship. I don't know anything about it. I never managed to imagine a party I attended would be targeted. Thief's still somewhere on board. It's a bit scary. Well, really, forget about the boost system, just catch a thief. Right. That's strange, I'm sure they don't let a mouse pass me. Hmm. Candles give off a soft light. Wait, how do the lights go out if there, there were candles? What? Also, uh, having candles like that on the ship it seems a bit uh, dangerous. <laughs> mm -hmm. Pretty darn dangerous sounding to me, but uh, m maybe it's one of them like uh, fancy candles that have uh, the little flames like a tiny little bulb. Let's see. <laughs> maybe maybe that's how that worked. This display stand has a built-in hologram system. We pretty high tech, eh? Oh, there's a thing. I don't need this data. I want this data. High polished mirror is fitted to the pillar. And then reflected the is reflected in the mirror on a pillar. Clean round table used for parties. Expensive wine is being chilled here. Yeah, I could jack in the wine case. All right. Was it that drunken customer said? Oh, I remember. He said 0506938930. Guess that's another thing for the lottery. Oh, hang on to that. Or perhaps it could be something else entirely. Sounds like some kind of code. Said there was some more in here. Oh, am I drunk? Nah, I don't have such a function. Oh, wait a minute. Drunkenness in my, in my kid's game? I'm busy researching how the program could get drunk. It's fascinating. I highly recommend a 50 bottle of Natopian wine. It's smooth with a slightly acidic fragrance. You must try it. Uh. Oh, there wasn't anything here. I figured it out. I know how it was done. 
Well, well. It's a table, it's a buffet, it's a mirror, it's it's a mirror. It's a mirror, the mirror is rigged somehow. Mirror. Oh. Well, it's... A magic mirror, the reflection. When you break it, um... That, uh, uh, reflection. Mirror's reflecting is correct, so when this mirror reflects light, it goes like this. Maybe travel over infrared rays when you jack in. That's it, using a mirror to reflect the rays. You jack in even from way off. So if you work back from the view computer, we can figure out where the thief is. Uh, exactly. I hadn't quite figured out that far yet, but uh... So we'll, we'll trace the light path back and hunt out the thief. Big brain. Alright, that's mirror and then boom, boom, alright. Oh. Why a suspicious person? No, no one came past here. I don't think anyone would try to get way through here. I did see something strange flashing in the engine room, though. But I don't suppose that has anything to do with it. Is it? Oh, it's a ventilation shaft. Maybe the thief got away out this way. Let's take a look. Oh. Are you okay? Ah, uh, I'm okay. Quick, the bridge up ahead. They've hijacked the ship. Oh, what? <laughs> What's the freaking kid gonna do about it? Look this man out. Head over the booster system. Huh? Wait, it's you! Bum, bum. Aren't you the guy from before? Bingo, why are you doing this? The booster system's our enemy. A enemy? Record developed this booster system, and it was their resort that ruined my village. Report there'll be more people like me if their booster system spreads around the world. I won't let that happen. And if you really want it, check in there and take in my navy and chip computer. I don't look like the talkie's gonna get me anywhere. Well, if that's how it's gonna be. Jack in, Colonel, execute. Oh. Strange. Looks like the party battle system isn't working here either. No time to worry about that now. Gotta stop this evil Navi as soon as possible. Let's get moving. Gotcha. Cyber hatch is now in operation due to flooding. There's no access beyond here. Please turn back. But you don't look like you're gonna do that. I would tell you how to get around, but I don't know. Do you want to ask anyway? Sure. Very well. The key to unlock the cyber hatch is at the bottom of this slope that's near it. But the lower part of the slope is underwater. Underwater, the oxygen gauge on the right screen will go down. It goes down to zero, your HP will begin to drop. If your oxygen runs out, when you only have one HP left, the area safety system will cut in and get you out. Oh, okay. Good, then I'll carry on. Yeah, you'll find bubbles, eddies, uh, and currents underwater. Collecting bubbles will restore your oxygen, but if you get trapped in an eddy, your oxygen will so drop suddenly. Hit a current, and you'll get swept along. But you can use the control pad against it to flow to stop. Yeah, it uses a lot of oxygen though, so uh, be careful. Near the key, there is a device, uh, emergency device that can return you to a safe place in an instant. Use it wisely. You understand so far? Good. That's all I got to tell you. I'm gonna go over it again. Just ask any time. I can tell you as many times as you want. So uh, anyway, good luck. Um, I'm good. I need some tea. <laughs> That's a good thing about the, the long saving time.
means tea time. Oh. Separate hatch is locked in one budge, one keyhole is empty. Of course. Oh, I see. Yeah, this is the S version of PN5. Kind of two screens after all. Oh, that was easy. Oh wait, I I'm gonna keep going though. Oh, peace. Plus the music of <laughs> the DS version and the GBA one is like very different. So, well, you know, the same tracks, but the audio font is very different. No crusty GBA <laughs> sound chip. Supposedly Double Team DS won't be in the collection. I don't remember seeing it. I, I'm pretty sure the uh, collection had... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's true. We just have Team uh, Team Colonel, Team Proto Man, the GBA versions. I could be wrong, though. I would like to be wrong. Wrong. This has been uh, a pretty good port of the game. So I'd say that's a tragedy. I consider Double Team DS to be the definitive version of BN5. Yeah. Finally getting some decent healing chips. And it is open. I suppose it was maybe because uh, of sales or whatever, who knows. Halfway. Not. I mean, didn't this game come out, come out uh, the first year the original Fat DS came out? So, kind of, they probably needed launch titles or early titles for the system. Because Nintendo was like, oh yeah, the DS won't be, uh, you know, it, it won't be uh, replacing the GBA. <laughs> and then it did. So it's a play transmission on GameCube. Uh, one of my friends owns, uh, owns that game and said it's pretty hard. But then again, <laughs> it's not a big fan of 2D games, so... Got pretty injured in that fight. Got a map now. Money. Get that oxygen. Oh, jeez. Okay. Let's not. I'd rather not drown. <laughs> you know, for DS fans could easily play auto DM games. Yeah. Because, you know, again, you know, back in the day, Nintendo was like, yeah, this, this is not a replacement. It's a... Coexistence console. Kind of like how, um... The Switch wasn't supposed to be uh, a replacement for the 3DS, but, but, but then it was a re replacement for the 3DS. 